What is up guys and welcome back. In this video, we're gonna be doing some trout fishing. That's something I don't typically do. I'm actually gonna be taking the boat, taking the old Alti craft to a local lake that actually stocks trout. And we're gonna troll around for some trout because that is pretty much the easiest way to catch them. Probably gonna do some pan fishing too, try and get some crappie, try and get some bluegill. And uh, yeah, we're basically just going fishing for some meat today. Stay tuned. Ready to catch some turd eaters? Catching a state record turd eater. That's what I live for, Jake. I'll wait all year for this. <laughs> We're out here trolling for shit eaters, Jake. Every yeah, every bad. trouter who watches this video is just gonna be triggered. I'm marking some fish down there. I don't know what they are. I think we're overkilling it. The next boat that shows up is gonna be like a plastic sun dolphin. Should I use the navy so we can run a line? <laughs> There's like no rhyme or rhyme or reason. Like death doesn't matter. <laughs> Structure doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> you have to have zero skill. <laughs> That's the problem. Is if you get too much skill, you're not going to catch them. As long as you have sharp hooks. That might have been a trout there. <laughs> Let me get the net. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't care you did it. He's jumping for you. Get him in the boat. We're keeping him. <laughs> We caught a shit eater. Jake, he slammed it, this didn't he? This, this trout eats worse food than my dog does. <laughs> he slammed it, didn't he? He smoked. Let me, let me get the live well ready. Oh my god, mission accomplished. That wasn't hard at all. He dropped. See how that took no skill? <laughs> actually pretty strong. See how that took zero skill, though? It took absolutely nothing. <laughs> but it's, you know, there he is. Yeah, okay. Let me pull it. Look at the live over right That was awesome. In a normal situation, I'd go back through there, but I don't think it matters. Better one? <laughs> Jake's smoking the trout. Jake's freaking smoking them. I was born for this. <laughs> <laughs> and he unhooked for you. Yeah, or no, he I didn't. He that one's a little bigger. A little bit, a little bit girthier. This is awesome. I was born for this. These guys are actually pretty strong. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm telling you, they fight good. They've never been hooked before. They used to just run swimming around eating shit all day. What's happening? I'm already 33% done. I'm... Damn it. He came back for it, Jake. <laughs> oh, that's a better one. There you go. Oh, that's a lot better one. Okay, stop going crazy for a second. Yes. That's not that's bad. That's a better one. Oh, yeah. See, the Joe flies with money. Pop right out. Look at that. That one's actually... That one's respectable. Jake, uh... I think we got it figured out. <laughs> Just use zero skill and you'll catch them. We patterned We patterned <laughs> All right. He came back for it. He did, too. He smoked it both times. He just, like, touched it. I definitely had hit, got hit back there, too. I remember when I was like, I think I just got bumped. Well, I had one out. Remember I, I like, went, oh. You just get bumped? No. Oh. When I, we were before that. Yeah. I had, like, he just, like, he, like, it, it felt like a bluegill kind of. I'm like, and then he came back and slammed it. And I was like, yeah. We know we can come out here a week after, a week and a half after they stopped. just happy that I got a $10,000 boat with, I don't know, $5,000 in electronics on it so I can go catch <laughs> shit eaters. <laughs> Doing a little trolling, Jake. Little trollsters. Oh, we, ain't, we ain't caught one in a minute, dude. We got competition. I know. Oh boy. Another freaking brooder. Yeah. He slammed it, Jake. <laughs> slammed. I found that one that just. He freaking just... slammed it. Get him in the net. <laughs> yes. I like this one's I caught. We're the best trouters of the East. That's a male, though. Look at him. Got a nice hook. Yeah. It's kind of cool looking, actually. Look at that, dude. I don't think they're supposed to have that like one of that size. Well, that's how you do it, Jake. See that? Look at him, Jake. See how he looks like he's just been eating turds his whole yeah, life? Yeah, he's not like a nice rainbow color. He's like. Oh, he almost jumped. He almost. He's a fighter. They're he's strong. a. He's a fighter. All right, go in with your buddies. Yes. Did it. The score is even now. Dude, he slammed that. That was like a pike hit. Like that, you caught the biggest and the smallest. That was kind of awesome right there. All right, guys. So we we're we we're literally just trolling Joe flies with what, like a one sixteenth ounce split shot, one thirty second maybe. It's yeah, it's small. And uh, it's small. That's four troutskis. Kind of getting it done. That's yeah. four more than my buddy Ben caught yesterday. <laughs> oh my god! Is that giant or is that oh, tiny? <laughs> oh, tiny. Do we even want to keep it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah but I'd say you just keep it. 
That's what you get for saying I caught the smallest fish. Oh, yeah, that one's kind of pathetic, honestly. Let's put him in there because it's not like what are you eat he's on probably got more aeration in here anyway. <laughs> that is, I don't know if that one might have slipped in. I don't know if that one was supposed to be stocked. Why do you hit it so hard? <laughs> I got the hook set on camera. You hear him jump? Yeah, he was. He was aggressive. I felt kind of dumb netting him. I'm not gonna lie. Is it a, is it a giant? Oh it, no. What? Don't lose him. I have to hand line it. Why? My what? reel's all f***ed up. What'd you do? My line's wrapped around my reel. Why'd you do that? You gonna hand line him? It's the biggest one. <laughs> what did you do? My line wrapped around my. Is he still on? Yeah. Better one. <laughs> all right, we're well, in. Cool. He wanted that. What the hell just happened? Look at that. Oh, he's bleeding everywhere. Bang. Yeah. Oh, it's a tiny one. Was it that? Yeah. I don't even know. Get that goldie in here. That one counts as mine. <laughs> yes. They're so small. Well, pretty though. First gold one. I was sitting here eating a sandwich. It's like you have a fish on. You have one on. So what are you talking about? No, I don't. Yes. Look at that, Jake. That's cool, though. See what color he is? That's why they call him goldies. Look at that. He's kind of yellow. All right, buddy. I'm almost done with the sandwich, dude. Oh, wow, one of them's dead. A lot of blood in there, buddy. Oh, what, we got seven in there? Seven. We're killing the game, buddy. Look at all the power bait floating around. A lot of power bait. <laughs> it's, it's floating through. I, I, one you I got one. another. Oh, this one's fighting. I think you're almost caught up here now. I, I am caught up. This is eight. Are you pulling four? Yeah. This one's flying. Oh, no! 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 No, it was bigger! Well, Jake, uh, we definitely got the most expensive boat. We got the most expensive rods. We got the most expensive electronics. We got the most expensive probably everything. We look like a couple of schmucks out here. And we probably have also caught the most fish, maybe. See? Money. Money buys fish. Yeah, and I'm honestly broke, so it's not really saying much. We're in weird West Virginia. My goal with this video is to trigger everyone. You want to really trigger some trouters? Call your bobbers bobbers. What are they called? In indicators. I don't think these are that kind of trouters though. These are more like your, I call them welfare trouters. Is it huge? That's big blue. Oh, whatever. Throw them, in the, throw them in the damn live well. How big is it? Oh my God. Might as well keep them. You want to? <laughs> yeah, I mean. Oh, Jake. Yes. <laughs> oh, no, they're, they're, they're studs. We'll keep them. <laughs> Whatever. Taking a break from the trout real quick. I was hoping there, there should definitely be crappie here, too. That was nice. Mixing it up a little bit. I have a mixed bag. That's got to be a crop. Oh, he's wrapped. Why are they so big? What is this? This isn't even a gill. Look at this. We've got like as many bluegills trout in there already. There you go. Oh, it's a crop. Is it? Yep. <laughs> yes. There you go. There's over nine. I'm keeping them. <laughs> All right. Maybe the crappie will be in here now. All right, Jake. We caught a crappie. Oh, God. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's big. Oh, what is that? Is that so a just crop? a giant gill? That's a giant gill. That's a That's crappie. a crappie. Yeah. Heck yeah. That was a, dude, that thing was fighting. Do you see that? Heck yeah. All right, Jake. Catching the meats today, Jake. I mean, pretty much. I mean, slay the trout, get some crappie. Giant gilskis? I thought that was like a bass or something. I thought at first, too. Maybe you had a large bass. Well, we just increased our fish total from like 7 to... 15? Probably more than that. 20. Catching some freaking blueskis now, Jake. Pretty good gill right there. What do we got going on here? Oh my god. The meats. Is that trout dead on the bottom? There's <laughs> just so many fish in there. Oh, they're crappie. Oh my god. Is that crop? Oh, I think that might have been. Oh, where am I at? <laughs> That's a crop. That's a good one. Oh yeah. He's like bleep. Yeah. You just had one too. Is it a crappie? I'm pretty sure it looked just like us. <laughs> We're doing stuff, Jake. Damn. We're out here doing stuff, buddy. How about I land three of these? Well, uh, it's another freaking cropster going in there. <sighs> Got a crappie, buddy. That's a pretty good one. That's a pretty good one. That's a dude. That's a good one. You did it. Yes. You caught your crappie. Yes. You caught your crappie. There's so many of them in here, but they're all that size. Good job, buddy. 
Good job. Yeah, yeah, he's good. You, I don't think there's a limit in West Virginia. I like him to be nine, though. All right, well, um, we are critically low on the trolling motor because we've been out here. It doesn't seem like we've been out here like all freaking day. Like the sun's starting to set, pretty much. We've got seven trout, a thousand bluegill, and four crappie. Kind of happy with it. We're gonna get stranded out here. I like <laughs> gonna have to call the Coast Guard. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. Look at all that. All the trout are dead because they're. Look at that. Look at that meat. Look at that meat. This trout here's nice. Not one that was nice anyway. A little dead turds in here. Big old gills. You know, decent crops. This one, this one trout looks huge now after like we haven't caught any else like that. That one, yeah. Look at that one. Yeah, so we got a pretty, pretty extensive mixed bag here. The trout fishing kind of started slowing down. You know, the old, the old shit eaters stopped eating. So honestly, most of the trout that they stocked are freaking not that big. I mean, that's the biggest one I think. And I mean, I have huge hands, so I make them look even smaller. But I don't know. I mean, I could measure him. He's only probably, he's probably what like maybe 14 and a half inches. Yeah. I mean, you know, whatever. This guy's dead as a doornail. Nice little male. I think I caught that one too because Jake didn't catch any big ones. Um, <laughs> Come on. I'm just joking. But did get a goldie, which that was a goal today. A nice little goldie. Pretty small, like all of them. We're keeping them. And then we were just hammering the big gills. I mean, some of these gills in here are just, they're all good. Again, I have huge hands, so it might not look that way. But, and then we caught a bunch of like nine, 10 inch crappie, nothing. Nothing giant, but eaters. So Jake and I are gonna divvy up these fish and uh, go home and we're both gonna have to clean some fish. But I mean, for the most part, successful day. We had to, like I said, when it got slow, we started fishing for the panfish and we probably caught, I don't know, 50 or 60 panfish and these are the ones we kept. So what do you think, Jake? Pretty good. Success. All right, so I'm gonna give you all the little ones. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Where's that, where is that little one you caught though? I gotta find him. He was him. dead on the bottom. Yeah, he didn't. He didn't last long. There oh, he is. There gills. he is. Look at all these gills. Where is he? Right, right here? there. Look at him. He's oh a my monster. God. He's actually not much smaller than my Goldie. He's a monster. He, he didn't last long in there. Look how beat. You can tell he was just still getting bullied at the, at the farm. <laughs> he got beat up. Good Lord. All right, let's divvy him up. So yeah, guys, you know, we were kind of making fun of the whole trout fishing. Hope I didn't offend anyone too hard. Those fish are stocked. They're thrown in there and I'm not really making fun of the fact that like the actual fishing itself, it's more of like the guys who take it so serious and it's all they do. And if you're one of those guys, I'm sorry. You know, we were just kind of like poking fun and uh, <laughs> if you're offended, I'm sorry. But we honestly did have fun. It was fun. It's not something I could do every day. There's no way. Not even, not even, couldn't even do it a couple days in a row. It'd be, it'd be, uh, it'd be kind of tough. You know, West Virginia kind of gets out of hand when they're stocking this trout. Like they just stock the crap on. They stock more than like any other state, which is insane. Like I know they stock more than Ohio, stock more than PA and a lot less water here in West Virginia. And most of the lakes are a lot smaller and there's a lot less people. So it, it's kind of insane. There's actually some really weird, some really strange stuff going on with the West Virginia trout. According to the federal government, all these trout that are being put in the streams and lakes are actually eating an endangered species. It's a uh, type of darter that is native here and, and these fish are, are eating them. They're called uh, candy darters. They're actually cool, pretty cool looking fish. I'm pretty sure I've actually saned some before in a saying that these trout are, are either eating them or eating their eggs or something. And the federal government is actually stopping funds to the state of West Virginia if they don't stop stocking the trout. And it's like a sum of $19 million. And honestly, I don't even care. I really don't care about these trout. I mean, they're fun for kids, which is really probably about all they should be. They don't really survive. They're not native. They're it's, it's honestly just kind of silly how much money has been put into it. Just stock some kid ponds and stuff for them. Stop stocking them and keep the keep the funding, keep the 19 million, and stock some other stuff like put some put some make sure all the creeks are loaded with smallmouth, all the rivers and stuff. Make you know stock musky, get the musky population back. I don't understand why everyone's making such a big deal about the trout. It's been weird. It's really weird how much they're, they're trying to do like a they're trying to make it like a tourist destination for trout, but they're not real trout, you guys. You can even tell by looking at them. Tell by the way their fins are, the shape of them, the, the colors. They're not real trout. They're, they're, they're farm raised shit eaters. Comment below, let me know your opinion on it. I know a lot of people around here love the trout. I just think that the, the money that they use to stock the crap out of these trout that aren't gonna survive could be used on uh, stocking some species that, that will survive and 
you know, establish a, a, a better native population. But all right, guys, that's all I have for you. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please smash the subscribe button, hit the like button, and I'll see you next time.